Are you suffering from cold and flu symptoms? Hi, I'm Janet Roach. I want to teach like-minded people what I've learned using herbs and tea to nourish your body. Is your throat sore? You know, that feeling like uh, you're swallowing razor blades, your head starts to feel all congested and blocked up. Oh my God, your nose starts to run if you're lucky. Or worse, your nose gets completely blocked and you can't breathe. You start to feel that cold and achy feeling and you just want to rug up in soft, warm clothes and lay down. You forget about most illnesses, but you never forget the flu. No wonder we're scared to get the flu. Even when the worst of it's over, you still feel really fragile and weak for like a couple of weeks later. Now hang with me. I've got a special free gift for you at the end. Uh, so I want to talk about this whole flu thing. I don't know about you, but I'm getting really concerned about the news that's coming from the medical professions and in the paper and that this year, just recently. And I think you will be too. Did you know that the experts are predicting about 4,000 people will die from complications of flu this year? That's actually freaking me out. There have already been 40,000 laboratory confirmed cases of the flu in 2019. And that is three times the number recorded at the same time in recent years. Experts believe flu cases could end up being the highest since 2017 when a quarter of a million confirmed cases were recorded. Now, I know 2017 doesn't sound that long ago, but this is actually really serious because the 2017 flu season was the worst since the 2009 swine flu pandemic. Do we all remember that? Last year, there were 58,000 confirmed flu cases in Australia. That's confirmed. And although the laboratory numbers don't show the full extent of the flu, because, I mean, most people don't get tested. It's predicted that about 2 million people, 2 million people will get the flu this year. Now, that is absolutely freaking me out. Let me put my tea down. I've written a book on the subject called Supercharge Your Immunity. Bear with me here. In it, I give advice on how best to treat the flu or how to shorten and reduce the severity of it, you know, the severity of the symptoms, if you're unlucky enough to catch it. I bust heaps of the prevention myths, you know, like don't go outside in bare feet in the cold. It actually, you won't get a cold from it. Um, and I compare natural ingredients with supplements. Now, I'm really, really, really keen to get this information into the hands of as many people as quickly as possible. The fewer cases we can prevent the fewer cases there'll be to infect others. And maybe, I mean, it's pretty dramatic, but maybe we can save a life. So I am giving this book away for free. If you would like a copy, and I really urge you to read it, just go to the contents below and click the link. Simply fill in your email address and I'll have it at your inbox in minutes. Some things that people don't really know, and that is that there are actually only two ways to catch the flu. All right? Two, easy peasy. One is from surfaces. An infected person has sneezed or, or touched a surface and left the virus. A healthy person comes along, touches the surface, picks up the virus, touches their face, and they catch it. The second way to catch the flu is from the air. When an infected person like coughs or sneezes, that's why we say, gosh, you're going to cough or sneeze, can you do it into your elbow? or if it just breathes into the air, the tiny virus particles, they stay suspended for a long time. A healthy person comes along, inhales the virus and becomes infected. It, it takes about two to three days for the virus to really take hold of you, but the symptoms can begin within 24 hours. An infected person is contagious almost immediately and can spread the virus before they're even aware that they have it. Now. This is freaking me out because people are dying from this stuff. So the single, single most effective thing that you can do to prevent catching a cold or flu, I know it just sounds like a no-brainer, but it is wash your hands diligently. Carry along a hand sanitizer. When you can't wash your hands, use the sanitizer. Now, I know that this sounds a bit like, you know, over the top, but I'm telling you that this really works. When you use public bathrooms, say. Turn the tap off with paper towel. 
dry your hands, preferably in one of those hand dryers, and we'll use the paper towel to open the door, dispose of the paper towel outside the bathroom. You don't want to be touching surfaces that lots of people have touched. That's how it all gets, um, that's how people catch it. Now, I like to wipe shared surfaces because I work full time and I've got a lot of people in and out of the place with disinfectant wipes and I like to try and keep the surfaces, like if there are surfaces that uh, we're sharing and that a lot of people are using, I get the disinfectant wipes, I do the phone, I do my phone, I do um, things like uh, the doors and that, just so that it just keeps us all safe. Now the second most effective defense that you can use, so that helps with the surfaces, is to supercharge your immune system. It's your best defense. Look, there are lots of synthetic medicines that you can buy to treat the symptoms of a cold, but keep in mind that that is what they do. The body still gets ravaged by the disease. All they do is mask the symptoms so you feel better. And then after the flu is passed, you still have a period of recuperation where your body has to build up its reserves. Now, I like to use natural remedies. Natural remedies are just that. They nourish the body. Okay, so they actually treat the disease. Don't just mask the symptoms and make you feel better. Well, you can do both. Natural remedies treat it. They treat the disease, making it shorter and milder than it normally would be if you already have it. And doing that, it reduces that impact on the body and therefore it sort of like reduces that recuperation time. So you don't have that, I don't know, a couple of weeks where you still feel all sort of fragile. Natural remedies use vitamin, minerals and trace elements to nourish your body. So you don't get sick in the first place. You've got that defense there. Now do you know why green tea is often referred to as the elixir of life? In addition to like heaps of antioxidants and this thing called EGCG, green tea is an excellent source of, get this, vitamin C, B2, B3, folic acid, beta carotene and vitamin E. It's also rich in potassium, calcium, phosphorus and magnesium. Oh no, that's not easy to remember. As well as small quantities of manganese, zinc and copper. What happens is when you put these um, herbs, and I'll tell you what the herbs are in a minute, when you put herbs that have the correct vitamins to nourish your body in hot water, not boiling water, these vitamins and trace elements and minerals come out into the water. The water, when you drink it, is because it's all in the correct uh, balance, You, your body actually can absorb it and that's how you nourish your body. Now herbs like lemon myrtle, calendula, hibiscus, oh, my favorite astragalus is amazing, and elderberries, they're packed with vitamins and minerals, and in a combination, they make a powerful source of nourishment. Look, when you drink a tea with those in it, you can actually feel it going down, you can feel it doing you good. Now, I've written a book called Supercharge Your Immunity. It's important. If you want to strengthen your body's defense, live longer and be disease-free, you want no shots, no drugs, no sick days. I urge you to get your hands on a free copy now. Really, I really mean it. Get a copy. Know what you're dealing with. Go to the contents below, click on the link, enter, enter your email, and I will send it out to you immediately. It's 24 pages, but it's got the real deal, the stuff that you need to know. And if you're already sick, you need this book now. And if you're well... Like the rest of us, you need to prepare for winter and the cold and flu season by nourishing your body. At Raw Essentials already, we have been drinking our tea for oh, three or four weeks. We, we know the program. The most efficient way to nourish your body is to drink, I think, our Raw Essentials immune tea. It has all of those herbs in it for 28 days. Four cups a day. Don't forget you can reinfuse it. Um, and it takes the four cups a day, I reckon, to really get it to kick in. Then two cups a day during winter. With that in mind, we at Raw Essentials Tea have joined up with our good friend, Miss Jasmine Alexa, to give one of our loyal tea, tea society tribe the opportunity to win a $300 voucher for any Raw Essentials Tea. You can choose what you like, but the reason that we put this on is that at this time of the year, I 
would use the whole voucher to buy immune tea for my friends, my family, the people I work with. If you can keep their immunity up, then it's going to protect you as well. Also, the prize is a $300 voucher from Jasmine Alexa. I have been wearing Jasmine Alexa's amazing designs for a couple of years now. I love them and I know that you will too. So to enter this competition, it's worth it, it's $600 worth of value. Go to the contents below, click in the link, but you only have until Thursday to enter when we'll announce the winner of this fabulous prize. Don't forget about our Tea Society Challenge. We're looking for 20 people to enter the challenge. We've got entrants from, it's so exciting, from France, America, UK, New Zealand who have entered the challenge and they're going to be participating on Skype. The challenge consists of 28 days of drinking either our Slim Tea or our Sleep Tea. You get to choose. We'll provide the tea, a gorgeous little teapot with a strainer and everything in it, our favourite. Instructions on how to get the best results, my book on clean eating, and we've done a deal with our new fabulous partners at Fernwood in Camberwell to offer our Lady Challenge members one month free membership. I'll meet once a week with the local challenge entrants at my home just to give advice and support. So to enter the challenge, go to the contents below and click on the link. Also, if you can't do it that way, I would like to see announce. Jake and I, I hope you can see that, are in all 26 leader magazines this month and we are on the front cover on page seven we have an article and it also has details about the challenge and how to enter so you'll be getting this free coming into your letterbox and we're very proud of it so keep your comments coming i i absolutely love to hear from you bye from janet roach now until next week and remember nourish yourself that's what we're trying to do here with this tea nourish yourself Bye now.